My name is Shirley Anita Chisholm. I was born on November 30th, 1924. I am of Guyanese and Bahian descent. My father, Charles Christopher St. Hill, is from British Guiana. My mother, Ruby Seal, is from Barbados. I have three younger sisters. Because of the stress on my parents, when I was five, me and two of my sisters moved to Barbados. My granny gave me strength, dignity, and love. I learned from an early age that I was somebody. I came back to the States when I was 10. Years later, I would know what an important gift my parents had given me by seeing to it that I had an early education in the strict traditional British style schools of Barbados. I got my Bachelor of, of Arts from Brooklyn College in 1946, where I won prizes for my debating skills. I was a member of the Delta Sigma Theta sorority and the Harriet Tubman Society. I met my husband, Conrad D. Chisholm, in the late 1940s. We got married in 1949. In 1952, I got a master's in elementary education from Teachers College of Columbia University. I first entered the world of politics in 1953 when I joined an effort to elect Lewis Flagg Jr. to the bench as the first black judge in Brooklyn. I ran for a seat in the New York State Assembly in 1964. I won the seat in December with over 18,000 votes over Republican and liberal party candidates. I was a member of the New York State Assembly from 1965 to 1968. My success in the legislator, legislature included getting unemployment benefits extended to domestic workers. In 1968, I ran for the U.S. House of Representatives. I won by a two to one margin, thereby making me the first black woman elected to Congress. I played a role in the creation of the special supplement nutrition program for women, infants, and children. I was one of the founding members of the Congressional Black Caucus in 1971. I announced my presidential bid on January 25th, 1972 in my Baptist church. I was the first black major party candidate to run for president of the US, which also made me the first woman ever to run for the Democratic Party's presidential nomination. During the, during, the Janu, during the Jimmy Carter administration, I called for better treatment of Haitian refugees. I retired from Congress in 1982.